so much of them shrouded in mystery. So they don't know the true power yet. Hmm. If I can take down Zelris like that, then you would be hardly, okay, Ludo Seal being a bit cocky, hardly be able to compete against me. You will felt by the might of the grace flash. Okay, why are we getting a shot of Zelris here? Interesting, okay. Damn, okay, he can extend his sword as well. So that wasn't like a metal covered with darkness. It's just darkness itself. Or oh, unless those darkness was stabbed in, maybe that was inside the ground, which I didn't get to see the full size of the sword. But it is longer than what I imagined. But anyway, I think he's using the darkness to block. Okay, what's happening? Is that touching? No, it's not touching his body. Oh, okay, he's he's touching it pretty nicely. Okay, look to look at this panel. It's full of action. Okay, there is Clash, he's stopping it, and then Ludo Seal kicking. No, he's actually dodging like all of that movement. Uh hope that makes sense. Okay, so they both are, and okay, there's hands coming in and then again dodging and yeah, I can't wait this to be an anime. Uh Alright, so far they are on equal term, but dude, look at this. They are destroying the entire place. Okay, what's on the ground? Oh, okay, that's just rocks. I thought that's somebody's arm or something there. Uh, but yeah, okay, things are just being destroyed. Alright. Interesting. Let's go, let's move on. Oh, okay, not bad. The one that thought Master Zelris, the sword was Zelris, the sword was me. Oh, so the nebula thing, that was him. Okay, even so, don't start getting cocky. Okay, the moment they think they are winning, that's when they lose. Okay, and that's basically what happening. But that's, that. I know it's made by light and stuff, but that still probably wouldn't be enough to finish him off. Oh, wow. Okay, you can see he bent down and headbutted uh, him. All right, go on. What? He's unharmed. Is that the limit of the borrowed vessel, Rudo Seal? Okay. Shall we get it start? No, shall we get started too, daughter of Belilid? He's so scary. This time I'm going to truly enjoy myself. Okay. Exterminate Ray. Alright, I'm looking forward to this. Exterminate Ray? Wait, he's back for Ooh! Oh wait, did he backfire? Okay, look, okay, look at the difference. He used the same magic as Merlin and way more powerful version. Okay, we are actually getting like a tease of what, like just how strong they are. All right. Uh, those guys are just getting pushed around by the shockwave. Dude, look at the size difference. But I don't know why Merlin using demon magic, right? I mean, see, he's also got the side of goddess clan as well so she must be able to use something that will be more effective against demons okay his magic is this much greater than lady merlin's eskono look for an opening and then run for your second treasure huh, huh? sure plans okay that's where the treasure is remember he threw it because you know he became that one so it's like no way no way no way no way no way yeah <laughs> okay look okay it, it honestly it is within the fire range but even if it's not, look at him. His eye popped out. Okay, uh, let's see. What's wrong, little girl? That's all you got? Okay, enchant infinity. Oh, dude. Okay, look at his reaction. Okay, but see, put the spear. Okay, no, I, th I thought the spear is going to go there. But, uh, you know, that spear, if the spear is goes, she can't pull out all the magic because that's her uh, second treasure as well. So, let's see. Okay, and then the big collision happened. Let's see. A direct hit? As expected of our Merlin. Even a top class demon can do nothing in the face of infinity. I will use this chance to grab uh, Rihita. Okay, and then somebody got thrown back. <laughs> His eye popped up again. Okay, he, he's becoming the comedian of this battle. But let's see. Whoa. <sighs> Alright, Merlin. What's going on with them? As if... No, it's as... It's as if anything I do has no effect on them. 
Is this their magic? Interesting. No. Apparently, through some circumstances, their original magic power was and still is sealed. But even so, they are celebrated among the demon clan for being the absolute strongest of all. Not counting the demon kings, kings himself. And the person and the reason for that is simple. They are strong without equal, fast without compare, and tougher than any other. Okay. Way to hype them up. But they, so then, are, are you saying they don't have any weakness? To put simply, yes. Okay. There's no known weakness. Like, I, I'm pretty sure that's what he's trying to say. I don't think there's like there's a person without weakness could exist. Even the demon can have a weakness. Ha, ha. Okay, something just... Oh! Wait. That attack, that's the same as the nebula thing. But why is it being controlled by them? And look at him, even he looks shocked. Okay, what just happened? You insolent maggots. You really think a lame attack like that would work? Okay, but it did scratch. And what? what is this? There's a light attack as well. What? They were wounded. If they don't have weaknesses, then we just need to make some. Her wisdom is vast. Her knowledge is grand. Nothing is impossible for the woman of infinity. See, I told you. And look at look at Eskanor at the back. Blushed. Okay. Um, this panel looked badass as well. An eye for an eye. A tooth for a tooth. Okay, I'm actually not happy with this title when you think about it. An insolent maggot. But then, yeah, we... If they, if they left it like this, right, without showing these weaknesses, I think this title would have worked, per, worked perfectly. But let's see. The top class demons are broken tears. Broken tears. But they, but our witch is also broken tears. <laughs> the experiments begin to create weaknesses that don't currently exist. All right. Chapter 291, people. Okay. Depth of the heart within the woman. Okay, this is, if you remember, this is how she first showed up uh, with Arthur. And with Zelris defeat, well, Zelris defeated? He's done? I'm pretty sure he's going to come back. Next up are the top class demon. Merlin takes these fierce opponents with no weakness heads on. Okay, uh, there is something behind. I don't know if that's her true self or if there's something else going on, if they're trying to foreshadow or something. But yeah, there is with something on the eye. Let's see. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. Okay, so they're going to fight on equal term. If you don't have weakness, then you will just make one. Don't go talking big after you just barely managed to leave a scratch on us, you little witch. Okay. For the time being, that is an improvement from doing absolutely nothing to make a scratch. There's an improvement. All right. Uh, it seems like they are walking slowly. Anyway, Merlin, those are not the kind of opponents that a bluff would will work on. Yes, but okay. There's again that same kind of attack coming in. It's like a trap. Where did that attack just now come from? I didn't see him uh, take any offensive action at all. Okay, it seems like the trap's also there. Okay, now you can see the amount of damage they got. What? The damage is increasing. Impossible. Of those wimpy little hits. Okay, but that's also mean they can heal, right? Double impact. I cast it immediately after the fight began. Don't you remember that spell? That disappointed you both? What? So that was... Then that wasn't the attack spell. Okay, so the double impact didn't do much. So I guess that's... It's like a setup for now. Anyway, with the first wave, spells containing all different elements that can be created by combining the four major elements are cast. All to determine which you both have the least resistance against. For Chandler, it was light lightning. And for Kusak, it was wind. The sec And then with the second wave magic to further lower each of your resistances to those vulnerabilities is cast. 
resistances to those who are to cast. That weakness magic is then further amplified by my own power infinity. Each time you get hit, your resistance will continue to fall and fall. A most magnificent ad advance. And look at both of them. They look shocked. Anyway, I pray I have never... No, I never have her as my enemy. <laughs> the fact that Ludo CL is praying, that tells you all. She is absolutely terrified. Pacifica, if I can just figure out the source. Absolute can't... Just before he says absolute cancel, he's getting hit. Okay, is that mean like that? Basically, before he planned to attack, is that when the magic actually get um, started? Again, where did that attack come from this time? Okay, the wind just started swirling and then, whoa, look at the amount of damage. Okay, it is again, when it's come to like, just like the end of the page set, I think, it's a broken magic, okay? You can't exactly pinpoint and say, okay, this is like this, this is like this. It's just too broken. It's like almost anything is possible at this point. And like, okay, both of them are, oh, look at him. Damn you. Okay, when he come back, he's attacking. The entire space is currently enchanted with the multitude, undetectable and invisible light, lightning and wind spell set to automatically react to both of your speech or your movement. Any incarnation or attack you may make. And they will continue to be recreated by my power. In okay, that's just OP, man. I mean, it, it's too OP. Okay. Until the breath ceases from your bodies. Dude, look at them. Look at the amount of it. Okay. They are being shredded. Okay. What is this magic? It's incomprehensible. I hardly know myself. I took a dual element attack magic and then just improvised. Making it invisible, undetectable, automatically casting, homing. And for that final touch, added infinite two to it. Okay. And like, that can't be fair. <laughs> I know, right? But anyway, but, but when, when did you even set those spells to begin with? Really? It was while... I was teleporting around. Oh, okay. So she was using the teleport. She put that in a loop and then she went and do something else and came back. <laughs> okay. Uh, trying to escape, uh, teleport around, trying to escape Zelris Oni, Oni, Nob Omi Nobus Nebula. <laughs> Hack. Okay. Lord Rudosiel, cast a miracle to heal Giltander, please. He used himself as a shield in order to protect you. He didn't do it to protect me, did he? Besides, I need to conserve every last bit of oh wow energy I can. I'm not see. This is the one thing I don't like about Rudo Seal. But whatever, let's go. Um, okay, the battle is going on. Okay, look at them. They're in a bad shape. For we, top class of demon, to be being disgraced by like by the likes of a human, is simply. Unallowable. Allowable. Green. Okay. What's so funny? Resident. Oh. She let her guard down. No. Mer Merlin. What's wrong? <laughs> okay. He started laughing. As expected of the napping death god. In a mere instant, he can take over the souls of his target and along with it, completely control over their life and death. That is the essence of his napping. You are rather, no, you are looking rather cute. Is that your true form? You should meet the same fate as you, as that boy, Arthur. But before that, I'm going to need you to remove that magical bullet hell that you said. Fufu. You can regret ever trying to take on a top class in hell. Wait, that means... The fact that he had to go inside and fight. Okay, if you guys remember from Naruto, like, you know, you know, um, Inojin or what the hell? Her name just disappeared. You know, yeah, that's her name. You know, um, her magic works. Pr well, her jutsu pretty much work the same. She can take in, go into somebody's head and then knock them over and take over the control. That's how it works. So the fact that they can see that means they can fight. But we'll see. You can regret uh, your conscience. 
you your very will is now my prisoner well then as you so called prisoner i got to respond to you wow okay so just but how i had already have said that you would try to possess me dude so just okay you can see how the size difference uh but anyway she just jumped on his chest is like i had already calculated that you would possess me okay so she didn't let her guard down did you really think you would be able to take me over or top up receiving that supreme deity's blessing i also was based on strengthening of my soul and spirit hmm it seems you still haven't realized the situation you are in have you fool that the one that stepped into hell is you to look at that saddest face um now i'm going to take my time and make sure i work out every last little bit of arthur's crutch okay are you finished hurry up and make this wench okay every time he speaks things going on please no release her spell hmm this is bad if this keeps up oh okay zelris seems like he's at Damn. Okay, look at the amount of explosion that's causing. I like don't get ahead of yourself. Your magic power is hardly enough to stand against the power of the demon king. Okay, but he is he did get attacked and he is bleeding. Okay, but this is thanks to the demon king power the magic is not working on him. Um and what happened? Oh. Ludo Zeal used this as a chance. Ha. Huh. Okay, he's bleeding. I wonder what's that I won. I finally put an end to this holy war that has dragged on for all this time. We the goddess club. Okay, wait. What what happened to? Can't you see the darkness around him or is that just a uh, clothing? I think that's clothing. Um uh, but there is couple of more demons left and there's one that I'm particularly worried about called Meliodas is still in his cocoon so let's see um are you watching mail your big brother has finally accomplished oh to their memories chill through my body literally chill through my body this is the moment oh man okay i'm not sure if you can see this but dude crazy okay all right come down um where am i what am i talking about what was i talking about okay uh okay merlin okay merlin remembers everybody oh, dude it's like my spidey senses tingling everything just spiked up all right okay uh every, everybody like what well, why why can i only remember the face of estrosa the one okay now it's it's coming back in now okay this is coming back in now let's see In that instant far off in the heavens gautha spell has come under okay this is the point the officially the spells coming up the swapped perceptions of estrosa of the 10 commandments and mail of the four archangels in the mind of all that knew them were destroyed the swapped procedure okay 10 commandments and the mail of the four estrosa in the land uh, all destroyed and that and the impact that it created will change the entire state of the battle across camera that's what i was saying like this is going to make a big difference so what what of the four archangels yet one of the 10 commandments for all that know him that shock will be there okay wonder why they are pointing at this with victory a hair away a sudden complete reversal of perception and realization males revival will bring disasters upon even them the return of the devil's manifest the return of hope okay there is a true title right that mean the only thing i can imagine is one meliadas emotion returning here and the other one is meliadas's evil self but they need to merge i'm not sure if he can accept like what do you need to do to merge them so that's that good chapter i'm not actually sure if zelris is actually down like 
I don't think he's dead, but he's defeated. I can safely say he's defeated at this point. And even Kusak and... Dude, you know, it's crazy. It's basically an experiment that Merlin did. It just pulls off this because I honestly did not expect her to defeat these guys just like that. It's, it, I personally didn't see that coming, but it did happen. Uh, looking forward to seeing what's going to happen in the next chapter, especially now everybody have their memory and... Uh, yeah, it's, it's going to be really interesting. Let me know what you guys think about this. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. What does that mean? I don't know. Eye for an eye, tooth for a tooth. I'm not sure. But honestly, having a magic called infinity is just too OP. That's, that's the whole reason why she was able to defeat two of the highest ranked demon. Um, I, I would love to see them battle a bit more. It, it, it is kind of disappointing to see them going down this way. I would love to see them in attack mode, seeing their magic and, you know, but getting to see explanation, a bit more explanation, but that's not how it went. So a bit disappointed with that. But other than that, this part where their memory is returning, that's just crazy I, I i did expect it in this chapter but it happened so looking forward to the next chapter people let me know what you guys think about this chapter in the comment section overall a good chapter like i said the only disappointing thing is that i didn't get to see kusak and chandler going on well we did see chandler fighting okay but then when it's come to kusak i would love to see him a bit more uh but yeah even goddess flash was a bit disappointing especially against kusak that was a letdown. And also Gil Thunder, he's on a uh, deathbed as well. So looking forward to seeing who's going to serve them, serve him. So yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comment section. And also the fact that uh, Chandler is defeated. I think that not true might, true might, true night might come up undone. So yeah, let me know in the comment section. Anyway, thank you so much for reading it with me. People join our Discord and yeah, stay safe. Have a wonderful day or night and see you guys with more videos.